Hi Tauruses, welcome to Josie K Tarot. Thank you so very much for stopping by my channel. If you're brand new, thank you to those of you who have come to me for the very first time for a reading. I greatly appreciate it. Thank you also to those who have donated to my channel. Um, I don't know if you know, but I'm trying to be brave enough to leave a 27 year job to finally go into my own business and um, still be able to be that successful mom. All right, so anyway, this is just a quick brief reading of an energy I was pulled to do for a particular energy that some Aries, Aries Tauruses may or may not be carrying. It may be something you've dealt with or will be dealing with. These may not be your energies at all, but this is an example of what a personal reading is like. Uh, so to start off with, Tauruses, we've got you guys kind of up in your head a little bit contemplating bringing something to an end or watching something coming to an end in your thoughts position uh, some of you are or this person that I'm pulling energies from or these people um, are moving slowly because in your foundation you have a very solid female figure you want to maybe manifest something with someone who had recently offered you their heart and in the next two to three weeks, you're contemplating a new path. And Spirit's saying, we can provide this path for you, but it may be a difficult path because you're going to have to cut away from connections, family, friends, etc. In your hopes and fears position, this person's saying, I've come so far, I have grown. And... This person's really looking at their connection with this person who is solid in their foundation. And Spirit's saying, remember what love is. Love is shining like the sun because of your connection. It's the reason you came together. Therefore, some of you guys have been just moving very slowly when it comes to this offer from, I feel... Mm, I don't want to give it a sign or an element yet. In your hopes and fears, we've got the Page of Swords. So it's like you guys might be kind of half stepping into a new path and half defending the old path. And in your outcome position, you're wondering if you should try something new or if you should go back and give something a chance. Now the person you guys are connecting to or the other person's energies that's connected to this Taurus that I'm feeling. This person's confused. They're worried about the path. They don't know what the path is ahead of them, but they haven't got much to lose. They're excited to hop, skip, and jump and take a risk. Even if in the past there was a difficult situation, I feel like maybe they're out of their situation. I don't feel like they care much that you guys are in such a um, moment of confusion or worry. In, your, in their thoughts position, they, they're excited to start a new path in love. And um, they want a solid foundation of a family. But Spirit's trying to communicate with this other person about secrets. And in the next two to three weeks, they're focusing on who you guys truly are, the nurturing side hoping and or fearing that you guys aren't going to accept their cup of love. But in their outcome position, they're going to be okay. In their outcome position, they may finally get some of you to come their way. And that's you finding contentment or it's their imagination of I'm going to have this in the next four to seven weeks because this video is a, the energies are lasting about a month and a half to two months. Now, I have to bring up the Lenormand cards because I forgot about them and now this is reminding me of this. So this energy speaks of a situation where there is some sort of commitment, maybe a marriage, partnership of some sort. And in the recent past, uh, there was a cold connection that may have been passionate but wrong. And now in the next towards the end of the next month and a half or two, you guys find yourself shining like the sun at home with mama or papa bear snuggled in and remembering what is most important to you. So you guys are passing a test. 
Congratulations. A lot of people are coming to the end of what may have tempted them in the past. And they are succeeding. The test will be done and the next nine years will be a beautiful partnership or trying to find one. So in the first week and a half to two weeks, you and or this person were hoping, wishing, praying on a star to have a passionate connection and then ended up wondering if that's what they want. Is this something true or not? You know, it's being supported by half wanting to just kind of sneak away and half wanting to remember the comfort of home and spirit saying, recognize when something is not healthy for you. And they're presenting the Lenormand cards of the mice in the book. So it's time to put an end or you are contemplating or have some of you, not all of you or whoever this is, you're putting an end to a chapter that was not a healthy one. So in the next two to three weeks, Spirit's saying, you know, you're kind of moving ahead slowly. Maybe with someone who is very fiery and fun. And Spirit's offering you the Life Renewed Acorn to start over again. In your path, outside of your path, whatever fulfills you, you have control over your path. But the Lenormand cards are saying, you are not anchored, stuck in a situation. You can always leave, right? But the broom is here to help you to sweep away the energies of guilt and shame. So in the next four to six weeks, look at you guys, when a third energy comes in, you put on your helmet, your cap, your defense mode, you're ready to survive no matter what, because you're setting goals to maintain and to protect that which truly fulfills you. Uh, spirit is bringing up for someone's energies a little bit about fantasy, about wanting to... Um, there's some, with the Seven of Cups in this, I see drinking and partying may cause, oh, look at it's talking about with the Lenormand cards representing those. Chatter, things to break in this tree. The relationship broke and it's trying to grow past that as nature can do. So there is a possibility for that to take place. If you guys stand strong in the happiness, the fulfillment, the blessings of the life you've been provided. Some of you are coming up over the edge and are getting beyond the test and are finally will re be able to receive your blessings. Uh, some of you are going to have to have that discussion and let someone go. But, you know, it was a passionate connection. A lot of people were tested with them. And the end of this year is how they're going to decide and what the next nine years of their path are going to look like, or eight, however. Long story. Thank you again for stopping by my channel. I hope to hear from you again very soon, or happy holidays. Take care, and God bless.